everybody, it's the Full Brown in the Garage here with Pete the Greek, and we're going to be working on his 2016 VFR 1200. What are we going to be installing there, Petey? Well, we're going to put the crash bars from Jimmy that came in the mail, so that's it. Right, well, let's open them up. Ooh, damn, they're big. Ah, that's what she said. <laughs> So what we have here, this is the Jivy engine crash bar set for the VFR-1200. It's constructed of 25 millimeter tubular steel. And what it'll do, it's gonna protect Pete's radiator and side fairings in the event of a drop or a crash. So let's see what they look like on the bike. So the side fairing is off. It was held in by two Allen head bolts and four push clips. Those have been removed and you can see the front of the crash bar will actually mount to a bracket that's going to bolt right here. Pete's already taken the bolts out but there are spacers that are pushed in there. They're 10 millimeter heads. We have to remove this bolt and that bolt and then we can spread it out enough to pop the spacers out and slide the new bracket in. So let's get started with that. So what we're going to do now is we're going to mount the crash bars to the side. Uh, Pete just test fitted the front piece across. It looked good? Yeah. All right, so let's get on to the front. I'm going to be looking at you. Look at that. Look at the you stop? Like you stop. Get out of the shot. So when we went to mount the sidebars, we found that the head of it is an Allen head bolt. So I don't have a big enough Allen head. So we're going to shoot off to the store and hopefully pick it up and be right back. Okay, so we went down to the parts store and we picked up a 10 millimeter Allen head. So uh, we're ready to go. Let's pop these babies in. One eternity later. All right, so we got the other side on, but I got to tell you, it was a real pain in the butt getting this to work. First of all, Jivy, if you're watching, I don't know what happened to the threads in here. I don't know if you powder coated these wrong. The threads are really bad, so we had to really clean them up by putting the bolts in and WD 40. Didn't have a thread chaser, but Jivy, you got to figure this out. I mean, the bars look great, but if they don't bolt up, what good are they? Um, also, they didn't totally line up with this hole right here, but uh, by keeping the motor bolts loose, we were able to kind of get in there and make them work. So, Let's put this baby on, and hopefully we'll get this one lined up. It was not tapped at all. All right, so, oh, look at this. Look at this. You're going to love this. Look at the front. Oh, get the f*** out. This one went right through. Look at that. Oh, that one actually fits. It's nice when something fits. All right, so put it in loose. This is hysterical. Hey, Jivy, you got one side right. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. We have the Honzeo tie. This is what you have with the Honda. Be careful, be careful. Merci beaucoup. Don't kill me with this bike, man. <laughs> Merci, mon ami. Merci, Jivy. I put in the bolt. All right, Jivy, so we got it bolted up. By some miracle, this actually lined up this side. Um, we cleaned up the threads, started bolting it on. Understand that on this side of the bike, the left-hand side when you're sitting on it, uses longer bolts. The right-hand side uses the shorter bolts. There are also these spaces on the front on both sides, which go between, um, I don't know, I guess between the engine and the frame, it looks like. So let's pop this in here and get the bolt in. By the way, the GV engineers must have been like, oh, 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 oh what are you doing? This so is this fantastic. Side, they forgot to do this side, so they just, oh, 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 on this side. Okay, so at this point, I just want to let you know that for some reason, we all thought that Jivy was a French uh, company. Turns out they're not French, they're actually Italian. But for whatever reason, we thought they were French, so Pete started with the silly French accents and the silly French jokes, and of course I had to jump in and join. But um, now that we know that they're an Italian company, in the future references to Jivy, we will be sure to change both our accents 
and our jokes. So let's get back to the video. Thanks. You know you're not on camera though. You have to stick your face in there. Oh, oh, oh. oh, oh. <laughs> Jivy, your directions are awful. Absolutely awful. So the final piece de resistance <laughs> is this finishing touch from Jivy, which hopefully will go on quick and easy. Hopefully. 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 Nothing is quick I and easy with the French. I don't believe it. Needs a school diver. Except Napoleon, he was sort of quick and easy. Thank you. Is it regular or the Philips? It's the Philips. The Philips school diver. I think these are the worst French accents anybody's ever done. But you know what? No matter. Aren't you happy we did this? Yeah, this is this is a piece of cake, man. This is easy. Now. Final touch. Thank you, Jimmy. Plugs. So it doesn't look completely horrific. Horrific! Excellent! Alright, so the bars are done. They look amazing. Uh, at the end of the day, I guess that's all that matters. Uh, they will definitely give you protection. But all kidding and all jokes aside, Jivy really the directions were terrible. Um, the, the, the threads in the front here were all messed up. We had to clean them up. But um, I don't know. I guess we expected better for the money. But like I said, the end result is they look really great on the fairings, real nice and tight. So uh, Pete, what do you think? Oh, quality control. <laughs> All right, on that note... Other than that, yeah, it looks fucking yeah, awesome. Yeah, it looks, it looks hot. So other than that... Be awesome. Um, yeah. I got a shower. So, uh, ride safe, everyone. I'll we'll see you. I'll take a shower with him. Oh, great.